what's good youtube it's your boy trevi trev and i'm back with another video back with another clutch video you know i'm in the middle of instacarting i'm doing my thing i'm just trying to make some extra money before i move but i wanted to make this video because you know i observed a lot of things during my time instacarting this past couple weeks to the point where i'm starting to realize things about the world that i did not think were true until i started instacarting like for one i never realized how how much like what we eat and what we do contributes to obesity because like as i've been going through these stores as i've been shopping for people as i've been doing things i've noticed a drastic difference in how people eat and what they look like and you know i'm not the person to judge what people look like you know we're all different we all have different shapes and size and we're all beautiful in our own way but i've noticed the difference between the people who eat really healthy and the people who eat kind of bad and it's like a eureka kind of thing because when you see it firsthand you're like damn this is like crazy because you know you expect people to look a certain way based on it what they eat like and i'm not even trying to be judgmental or anything but it's just an observation i noticed and why america is so obese because a lot of people when i like shop for their groceries or whatever and i look into their basket and i pick items i'm seeing a lot of cookies i'm seeing a lot of orange colorful juices i'm seeing a lot of fattening foods that have no nutrition and then when i go to deliver it to them and i see the person i'm like oh no wonder this is what they look like oh no wonder this is what they look like this is where they live and when i see like nicer vegan options organic options nicer options i see like the person i'm like oh they look good or oh they're healthy or oh they live in a nice area and i started to notice that as i've been instacarting because you know i'll deliver to anyone so i've noticed the drastic difference in healthy options and what people look like because you know a lot of people will say oh it's a money thing oh it's this thing and i'm like no it's a mindset thing because as you go into these stores you start to realize a lot of these items they're like only like slightly less or slightly more than each other based on if they're organic or if they're vegan or whatever but the people who choose the better options usually look better and they live in a better area and they're they're and honestly they tip they tip and they're nice to talk to like i was talking to this, this she was beautiful like this girl she was a fitness um she was like a fitness personal trainer not like an ig model but she was like a legit a model and then like when i was shopping for her and then i delivered it to her I asked her like, what are some secrets? Cause I work out and she looks very well and she's 30 years old. She's like, oh, I just eat healthy. I get things in the store from Panera. I shop at Sprouts. I work out, I do this. And talking to her was like amazing. Cause I'm like, damn, this person's got it together. I like, I like delivering to her and she looks good. Her energy is on. But then when I deliver to the hood and then this lady bitched at me for not having some Hawaiian punch, I'm like, what the hell is wrong with you lady? I'm like, I did all this shopping for you, all this, and your lazy ass could have got up and went down the street and you're gonna treat me like this? This is why you're miserable. This is why your gut is hanging over your stomach. And then it's like, when I see that, I notice like America, we're moving in a direction to where people are so lazy that they want other people to shop for them. And then when you see the person and you see what they look like, you're like, oh yeah, I wonder why. Because they don't do anything for themselves. And my message to you as my viewers is to do something for yourself. Eat healthy, hit the gym, do what you gotta do because a lot of these options that are in the stores, they're contributing to the obesity crisis in America. And I can imagine if some people have kids and they got their kids eating like this with no nutrition, no wonder our generations are so soy and weak and they just all like, like don't exercise and they don't have the proper options in school. And then they don't like, they don't have anything to go from. And then at home, it's not helping them either. So when I see more stuff like this, it got, it has me thinking like, oh, we got to make better choices and America has to get better at providing different options. And we have to listen to the right people because there's nothing wrong with having a little bit of weight on you, but you shouldn't celebrate being obese. You want to be as healthy as possible. You want to be ripped. You want to be in the best physical shape as you can. But I wanted to make this video to talk about my observations and hopefully things get better as I Instacart and as I see more of this in reality, because I want to do something in a meaningful way to help people like lose weight or gain weight or be in their best shape because when i see this stuff while i'm shopping i get disappointed because i can kind of pick i can kind of pick what this person looks like based on what they shop and what they eat but hopefully things change for the better i just wanted to give you guys my observations as i was instacarting and you know that's just the video i wanted to make for today hopefully you guys like comment and subscribe i'm going to make a couple of videos before i get into my new apartment but i just wanted to make this video and explain some of my observations so I'll see you guys later on the next video and y'all take care. Bye.